Right, so lesson 98 is on the sum of the angle measures of triangles and quadrilaterals. So here we show the information. The sum of the interior angles of a triangle is 180 degrees. So if I add up all three angles, it's going to equal 180 degrees no matter what triangle I have. And then with the quadrilateral, if I add up all four angles, it is also going to equal, it's going to equal 360 degrees. No matter what any of the angles are, all of them added together will always equal 360 degrees. So this helps when we have a missing angle. So here it wants me to know, want me, wants me to figure out what angle A is. Okay, so I know that all the angles added up together has to equal 180. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to add 60 degrees plus 70 degrees. 6 plus 7 is 13. So I know that those two angles add together equals 130. So I'm going to subtract that from 180 degrees. Okay. 8 minus 3 is 5, 0. So that means angle A has to equal 50 degrees. Otherwise it won't add up to 180 degrees. All right, with this quadrilateral, it wants to know what angle T is in this picture. Okay, so again, I know if I add up all of these angles, it has to equal 360 degrees. So I'm first going to add these up. So 80 plus 80 degrees is 160 degrees. Okay, and I'm going to do 160 degrees and add that to 110 degrees. Okay, that's my three sides here. And that's equal to 270 degrees. So if the whole thing has to be 360, I'm going to subtract 270 degrees from 360. Borrow from the 3, 3 becomes a 2, 2, 6 becomes a 16. 16 minus 7 is 9, 2 minus 2 is 0. So angle T has to equal 90 degrees. And that's it. Good luck with your homework.